，三藩市為咗要打擊市內嘅有組織盜竊同埋其他嘅罪案，將會喺全市大約一百個街口開始安裝四百部車牌閲讀器。市長布利特表示，呢一種技術能夠協助警方執法，喺打擊零售盜竊、汽車爆竊等罪案上可以起到相當大嘅作用。毛浩然報導。三藩市舊年收到州府一千七百三十萬撥款，用作打擊有組織零售盜竊。隨後，市長布里德提出一項喺市內安裝車牌閲讀器嘅法案。法案喺今年一月通過。當局表示，警方使用車牌閲讀器嘅權限包括辨識同罪案有關嘅車牌，通知警方關於被通緝人士同車輛。協助尋找受害者、目擊者、疑犯同失蹤人口等。有關閲讀器唔會用作人面辨識，亦都唔係紅燈或者測速攝影機，並唔會發出告票。市長布里德表示，隨住選民通過依提案，警方將會被容許使用更多科技執法。佢話呢啲唔同工具有助三藩市改善治安。I'm really excited about what that is going to mean for helping us with surveillance technology and drone technology. Well, you know how the police in Los Angeles, I think they used to use helicopters. Instead of helicopters, we'll be using drone technology to help us combat a lot of those issues as well. 警察局長 Bill Scott 話，部分閱讀器安裝妥當，目前已經運作當中。佢話：市內超過七成罪案涉及車輛，形容呢種技術可以協助警方拘捕疑犯。We have not had the ability to do what starting today we will have the ability to do, and that is track those vehicles when they're using crime, give our officers the advantage, so we we can catch people if they commit crimes in the city. 地检官郑安仪表示，车牌阅读器亦都可以喺法庭上起到作证嘅用途，有助阻吓不法之徒犯案。People will understand that they cannot do that here. That that functions as a deterrent to those who are thinking about coming here to rob our most vulnerable, to break into our cars, to commit theft in our stores. Because now they understand we have the tools to catch them and to prosecute them. 三藩市市府同保安公司 Flock Safety 合作，將會逐漸喺市內大約一百個街口安裝四百部車牌閲讀器。目前包括灣區在內嘅多個警察部門，全國有超過五千個執法單位使用呢間公司嘅服務。二十六台記者毛浩然報道。